Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best travel cameras. Starting at number 5. OM System Tough. Tough cameras like the TG6 are freeze-proof, shock-proof and waterproof and can therefore be used in scenarios that you simply wouldn't consider with your phone or expensive camera. And for that reason the TG7 is still one of the best travel cameras you can buy. Its industrial design feels reassuringly rugged, while large buttons make it convenient to operate beneath the waves or while wearing gloves, plus its 3-inch LCD display offers decent visibility in most conditions. We found image quality to be reasonable for a camera with a 1-2.3-inch sensor, with nice, rich colors although there was a tendency to overexpose and blow out highlights. An equivalent zoom range of 25 to 100 mm is fair, plus the inclusion of 4K video and raw shooting enhance flexibility. Its image quality might not match your phone for regular photos, but the TG7 will allow you to be capturing extreme travel memories when you otherwise couldn't, plus there's a range of useful accessories such as a ring light for close-up photography. Coming at number 4. GoPro Hero 12. If you're looking for a high-resolution action camera for your travels that's as comfortable shooting smooth videos as it is crisp photos, then the GoPro Hero 12 Black tops the bill. It was an underwhelming update of the Hero 11 Black, but that's not necessarily a bad thing because that camera was already highly capable. There's the same 1-slash-1.9 in sensor with versatile 8-9 to aspect ratio you can reframe footage for different social channels without sacrificing quality, and its max resolution of 5.3K-slash-60P beats the DJI Osmo Action 4. You can capture dramatic time warps at the full 5.3K resolution, shoot photo sequences as a rapid 30 frames per second, and pull 24.7MP stills from 5.3K video. Design-wise, there's no change to the Hero 11 Black, the two rugged models are physically identical and come with a large Enduro battery as standard, giving more time between recharges on the road. The same interface lets you tweak the user experience, with easy and pro modes to suit your skill level. Superior Horizon Lock and Hypersmooth 5.0 Smarts do a remarkable job of stabilizing handheld video. Minor updates from the Hero 11 Black are mainly for pros, including flat log color profiles, 10-bit video, and multi-channel audio capabilities. For most people however, there's little reason to upgrade or to pick the Hero 12 Black over its predecessor which could save you a little money. At number 3. Nikon ZFC. Travel photography is all about capturing memories and Nikon ZFC fully embraces the concept of nostalgia. It's a stunning homage to the 30-year-old Nikon FM2 complete with retro styling, dimensions and dials. Despite the throwback design, it's a very modern camera inside, sharing many of its specs with the capable Nikon Z50. While some photographers might wish for a full-frame sensor, the ZFC's APS-C number does a stellar job of capturing stills and 4K video, aided by reliable tracking autofocus. Our tests found that its 20.9 MP sensor had an excellent handle on noise, especially under ISO 800, while dynamic range was impressive. Its variangle touchscreen is also a brilliant addition, making it easy to frame travel selfies or folding away completely for a leatherback look that lets you pretend it's the 80s. The Nikon ZFC isn't as sturdy as the camera that inspired it, there's no weatherproofing, for example, but it's still a beautifully unique camera for casual use. And with dedicated dials for ISO, shutter speed and exposure, plus a customizable lens ring, it's also an easy one to control on the go. Number 2 of my list. Ricoh GRII 9. If you'd rather a truly pocketable camera with excellent image quality for city breaks over a rugged shooter for outdoorsy adventures, then the Ricoh GRII 9 is one of our top picks. It packs a larger APS-C sensor, the kind you get on much bigger cameras like DSLRs, and a fixed 40mm f-2.8 lens capable of pin-sharp photos. It's a particularly popular camera with street photographers, and one of the few true compact cameras still being manufactured in 2024, thanks to some smartphone-beating features. You get a handy macro photography mode, 
clever snap focus setting for preset focus distances, and some lovely color profiles and in-camera photo editing, you might just discover a love for black and white photography with the GRII 9. The 40mm lens is a versatile focal length for everyday photography offering a similar perspective to the portrait lens on your phone, while the Ricoh GR3 alternative has a wider 28mm lens and a similar field of view to your smartphone's main camera. And number 1. OM System OM. The OM5 is only a relatively minor update of the Olympus OMD EM5 Mark III, but its combination of talents make it an ideal travel camera in our book, particularly if you want the flexibility of interchangeable lenses. It shoehorns a lot of features into a compact, weatherproof body that's compatible with a wealth of equally small lenses. Most of its skills, including excellent in-body image stabilization and computational photography modes, are also designed with travelers and adventurers in mind. Our tests found that the OM5 delivers excellent video and stills quality for its size, helped by a stabilization system, good for 6.5 stops of compensation, that gives you a high hit rate of keepers. We also enjoyed the high-quality feel of the camera's dials, as well as in-camera software tricks, like live ND and in-camera focus stacking, which are ideal for macro shots or blurring skies for an ethereal effect. Less good are the fairly average EVF resolution, for k 30 p limit for video and relative limitations of its smaller sensor, but these are all acceptable trade-offs considering this camera's size and price. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.